All right, guys, so this is just me showing you the half bath, the before, and then you guys are going to enjoy a haul of some of the things I got to implement in this bathroom. I was so tired of this peach orangey color, and I was so tired of this big vase and all this stuff. I'm actually selling that vase and all the fillings inside of it. Um, I just felt like the bathroom just needed something else. It wasn't giving me what I thought and not what I wanted and basically I just kind of dealt with it because I wanted to utilize what I had but a lot of the things that I had were in different areas of my home and because I didn't want to get rid of them and buy other things I was trying to make them work but it wasn't making me happy so I wanted to brighten this bathroom up and just get it together that mirror is like something that was given to me and it needs some true TLC so in my next video you will see all the TLC and all the things we did to prep this bathroom and get it right and then you will also see the reveal but keep watching so you can watch and see all of the items I purchased for this bathroom put this inside here because this was one of the plants that I was going to put in the bathroom as well I don't know if I am going to but this pot was created by me because guess what this is a Ollie's pot and it broke the day that I was trying to spray paint it it broke on me so I literally wrapped it with some twine that I had laying around this one ran out so I had to put this on top my mom was like hey that's nice even though I didn't you know mean for it to be like this I just wanted it all like this this came out perfect and I actually love it here in the living room so I think she might just stay right there so I am sharing with you um, some of the things I accumulated so it's like a haul and some stuff that well only one thing that big face here is something I had in my home before it was on my dining room table in South Carolina so I pulled that up out the basement remember I told you I wasn't getting rid of it I think I have a great idea for this big tall base this thing is really tall so I have that and I end up getting spray paint because I want to change the color of these two pots and a couple other things in the bathroom so I got these from Ollie's and I showed you guys these before I just took them out to put them in the hall for those that are new and those were $3.99 and these are like a ceramic pot and you can't beat that price and guess what if you're a plant person they have drainage holes so yeah um, got that and then I have this little pot that I got from Ikea when we went to Missouri for a vacation and also I got this little trash can that I thought was the cutest. Oh my gosh. I didn't get to share this with you guys um, because I lost my laptop, which a lot of the footage was gone and I had to do a mini haul. But anywho, this black and white trash can, which I thought was so freaking cute. And it has a container that you can pull out in the inside to just dump the trash. And it's just like a little press down and it'll come up. Um... This is a plant that I just recently got from one of our local local supermarkets that I thought was too cute. It was $3.99. Um, and I was looking at her inside here. I'm like, ooh, maybe we can get away with putting her in here. Because if it's on the shelf, you can't tell, right? That's really cute. So, we have her. And y'all remember my little teeny preemie baby succulents I got from Whole Foods. So, I have those and then this was a candle that i got from burlington remember burlington had the um 70 off i don't know what that is 70 off um this candle was like literally i think like a dollar and some change not even and it smells so good it's called wendy bellissimo and i got that from um burlington when they were closing the store because they're going to another lo bigger location I got this from Burlington as well, and this was like a dollar forty something, or I think it was ninety percent off, guys. Not seventy, I think it was ninety. Yeah, it was really low. I remember I showed you guys the um, haul. I'll try to put that haul below of all the great things I got and how much it was. It was like unbelievably, unbelievably cheap. And these two vases as well, I got from Burlington super duper cheap and this is the other baby succulent I forgot to put pick it up and these are real these are real succulents these are not faux and then these are in a ziploc bag because the original packaging broke um, these are anchors for I'm thinking plexiglass because I think it's cheaper and easier to get cut at Home Depot 
versus going to a glass cutter and paying five dollars a cut so i have an idea with these but eh, we shall see we shall see if this idea makes it um if so you will see it in the video um on some shelving in that little nook that i want to do but we, we shall see we shall see and then i got these here off of facebook marketplace nope offer up ten dollars i paid for these three shelves and these are some shelves oops these are some shelves that you do not need. They're not um, wood or glass or anything, so that's good. You do not need any hardware. It's something, it's a patent pending, and it is supposed to be just put it in the corner. And if anybody has these or seen these, tell me about them. And you just push, and blades come out on either side, all three sides, and it anchors into the wall. Now, this was another idea for the nook but also other idea for something else in my bathroom so you guys just stay tuned i want to go to home goods because it's something else that i want i wanted to spray paint something but i think i'd rather just go buy one from home goods so if um i do you guys will see it inside the video of the reveal but this is my mini haul from for my um half bath and i hope you guys enjoyed it please share and stay tuned i will be sharing my reveal of the bathroom very soon so just stay tuned all right later gators